Hello, my name is Dan Caponia, and I'm the Director of Graduate Admissions and Recruitment at Clarkson University. Thanks for joining me today for the special online graduate school overview and application process tutorial. Let's get things started. This presentation will cover what Clarkson University's graduate school is and where it's located, as well as the programs, application requirements, and costs associated with our master's and doctoral level degrees. Clarkson University's graduate school as a whole is currently made up of three, but eventually four campuses that are located from Canada's front doorstep to the hustle and bustle of the Big Apple. Our main brick and mortar campus is located in Potsdam, but we also call Schenectady, Beacon, and soon Manhattan home as well. You'll find more grounded, research-based programs in Potsdam, vibrant and immersive online course offerings, and professional programs in Schenectady and our cutting edge Masters of Science and Engineering Management program in Beacon. Our Manhattan location at Pier 26 is currently under development, so keep checking Clarkson.edu for updates. Clarkson University's graduate school boasts some fantastic rankings and accolades. Some important stats are one in five alumni lead as an owner, CEO, or VP of a company. CU is ranked number one among all upstate New York colleges for alumni salaries and number three statewide. And we had 100% placement for our MAT program graduates in 2017. I'll give you a second to look through all of the other impressive recognition our programs have received. The main hub for all things graduate school is our Capital Region campus located in Schenectady, New York. This is where my team of two assistant directors and I are located. Assistant Director Brad LaMare works with all of Clarkson University's School of Engineering and Master of Arts in Teaching applicants, while Assistant Director Angela Keel works with all of CU's School of Arts and Sciences applicants, as well as CRC-based healthcare business programs and online MBA applicants. All of us can be reached directly at graduate at clarkson.edu. The Capital Region Campus offers programs that are more so geared towards the working professional, as CRC-based degrees don't necessarily offer research-based opportunities or laboratory-based experiences in the classroom. This slide will list for you all of the degree offerings at our Capital Region Campus. Please take a second to review. Students who are looking for research facilities, on-site labs, faculty mentor programs, researcher teaching assistantships, or even university-run housing should really consider the programs held at Clarkson proper in Potsdam, New York. This location is home to our fantastic Ray School of Business. Located in Snell Hall, the David D. Ray School of Business offers a residential one-year MBA that can be completed in nine months and an, an international MBA for those students looking for some international flair in addition to their business studies. If this sounds like you, you can actually contact any of the three individuals listed on this slide for further information. Chris, Nick, and Darcy are always willing to help and will serve to guide you along the way. This slide will list for you all of the degree offerings at Clarkson University's main campus in Potsdam. Please take a second to review. Now let's jump into the graduate application process itself. Basically, there are six steps you need to be familiar with. One, you need to set up an account on our application portal at the link on the slide. Two, you need to complete the online application. Three, you have to upload all of the necessary documents. Four, make sure to enter all of the proper recommender email addresses or to upload any pre-existing letters you may have. Five, click submit. And finally, six, your completed application will be reviewed on a rolling basis as there aren't hard deadlines necessarily. So at this point, you're probably wondering what makes up a completed application. Well, this application checklist We'll walk you through just that. You need to make sure that you submit an application form, statement of purpose, a resume or a CV, all collegiate transcripts, two to three letters of recommendation depending upon 
your intended area of study, test scores, and any supplemental information you think would be important for the admissions committee to see. Now let's do a deep dive into each of these uh, requirements. Here's a quick snapshot of what to expect from the application form itself. As you can see, it's pretty self-explanatory. It shouldn't cause you much grief. However, should any questions arise, always feel free to contact us for guidance at graduate at clarkson.edu. The statement of purpose, or the essay, should be a brief synopsis that basically tells us why you, why us, and how can we help you get to where it is that you want to be. You must make sure to upload an up-to-date resume. Even if you do not possess any work history, please list any volunteer experience, especially if it's relevant to your studies, in some sort of resume format. This is also a really good spot to list out some of the additional skills and certifications that you may possess but haven't mentioned elsewhere. When it comes to transcripts, there are four important rules you have to know. One, transcripts from all individual institutions you've attended post high school graduation are required to be submitted. Two, in order to be reviewed for admission, we only require unofficial transcripts. Three, in order to actually enroll at Clarkson, you must submit official copies of all of your transcripts. And finally, four, if your transcript is not in English, please provide the original language documents and a translation as well. Most programs at Clarkson University require three letters of recommendation, but some only need two. So please become familiar with your program's requirements. We process all letters of recommendation electronically and the online application will ensure that you don't hit any snags with this portion of the requirements. However, if you or your recommender run into any difficulty, again, please contact us directly at graduate at clarkson.edu. Not all programs require test scores to be submitted, but a typical successful Clarkson University graduate school applicant possesses a GRE score in the upper 60th percentile or a GMAT score of 550 or higher. GRE or GMAT scores may not be required if you possess five years or more of professional work experience or are a Clarkson alum, depending on program. For international applicants, a TOEFL score of 550 on the paper-based test or an 80 on the internet-based test are required. We will also accept an IELTS score of 6.5 or higher. Supplemental information refers to any additional research work, publications, conference presentations, or certifications that you may want to upload for our review. Uploading these documents are, are, are not necessarily required, but they do add some very strong value to your application. Now that we're through the application process and its requirements, let's talk a bit about cost. Clarkson's cost of tuition ranges from $28,000 to $43,000 and overall cost of attendance for those factoring in housing as well as additional expenses could be forty-five to sixty thousand dollars. However, please note that these numbers do not figure in any sort of scholarship or assistantship that you may end up qualifying for. Now when it comes to graduate scholarships and assistantships, all admitted candidates are considered and there isn't a separate application required. We will reach directly out to you and let you know exactly what you've qualified for. Okay, so now we've made it to the point of the presentation that I'm sure you've all been waiting for, the end. Now, as a thank you for making it through this tutorial, my team and I would like to offer you a $50 application fee waiver to the Clarkson University Graduate School application. Clarkson University alums don't need a waiver since their application fees are already waived internally. But for the rest of you, please use the code on the screen CU Grad Admissions on your application to receive your credit. Please note, proper capitalization is necessary. Sadly, as with all free things, there is a little bit of a catch. Unfortunately, if you're applying to our OT, PT, or PA programs, we are unable to offer you this waiver because those programs use a separate application outside of the control of the graduate school. Thanks again for viewing this online overview of Clarkson University's Graduate School and our application process tutorial. Please feel free to use the contact information on the screen right now for any questions or concerns that you may have. We look forward to hearing from you soon.